now let us begin with our today's topic representation of rational numbers on a number line that means we have to represent the rational numbers on a number line to understand this topic we have to take one example let us mark the rational numbers minus 5 by 2 minus 3 by 2 minus 1 by 2 1 by 2 3 by 2 5 by 2 on the number line to represent this number uh, numbers rational numbers we have to take three steps step number one mark integers on the number line you have to simply marks the integer on the number line that is on the right side we take z on the right side of 0 we take 1 2 3 4 or on the left side of 0 we take minus 1 minus 2 minus 3 minus 4 in step number 2 divide each unit segment into two equal parts that means equal to denominator in the given rational numbers we have in the denominator 2 that's why we have to uh, divide in equal parts into 2 so look at that number line 0 and along with 0 we have 1 2 3 4 and here on the left side we have minus 1 minus 2 minus 3 and we divide them into 2 2 equal parts 2 2 equal parts look after 0 we have 1 point and then we have 1 again we have 1 point then we have 2 again we have 1 point then we have 3 then 1 point then 4 you have to equal the segments according to the denominator here we have denominator 2 that's why we equal the parts into two parts now step number three we have to represent the rational number first 1 by 2 3 by 2 5 by 2 are represented by first third and fifth mark respectively lying to the right side of the zero why we take this integers on the right side because they have positive sign again look at the number line center we have zero after that one single point we have the, this is 1 by 2 then we take 1 after that we left on step number 2 blank so fill up here 3 by 2 after that 2 after that 5 by 2 then 3 then take 7 by 2 then 4 just like that you have to represent on the left side also in the left side we have minus 1 by 2 then minus 1 then minus 3 by 2 then minus 2 then minus 5 by 2 then minus 3 this is the representation of rational number on number line then minus 1 by 2 minus 3 by 2 minus 5 by 2 are represented by first third and fifth mark respectively lying to the left of 0 now it's assignment time to check your knowledge based on the today's topic representation of rational number on a number line to represent the rational number on number line you have to simply take three steps step number one you have to just uh, mark the integers on the number line in step number two you have to divide the number line into their denominator okay according to the denominator you have to divide the uh, line segment or number line in step number three so the, you have to put the integers 
according to the division of the numbers. Thank you students. Have a nice day. Bye-bye.